Who are you gonna send out next time, Lieutenant? Jason. And Vic Morrow. before an answer. Not this time. Well, maybe there is. We're not dead yet. We're not done yet. Kirby, you left the gun up there. It ain't going no place, Lieutenant. You should have brought it down. We were lucky to get ourselves down. All right, Kirby. We'll get it later. Kirby, if you're interested, I now owe you $379,448.20. Huh? The odds are still alive. I lost. Well, come on, pay me, Einstein. Soon, soon. You know, next time the odds go up. Get off it. Don't talk to me about next time. I ain't over this time yet. Huh. We're licking the odds. Both of us. You know, it's amazing. It's not possible, but we're doing it. Amazing. Well, maybe you ought to quit now. I've had a belly full of that hill. Well, go tell it to the man. He doesn't make it any more than you do. He's got his orders. You knock it off about them order things. I know all about them orders. He so has them. Gage, will you get a load of that thing there? He's finally reached an independent conclusion. The lieutenant still has his orders. Just get off my back, you big lug. All right, Kirby. It's hard enough on everybody. and dies, that's all you can say? What do you want me to say? Something, I don't know. Hmm. 
Morgan's dead. Lesson two, Klein Schmidt. You lose a lot of friends in this war. three times. We went up cold, we went up under mortar cover, we went up under sniper cover. We got clobbered each time. I can't just keep sending my men up there without effective help. I just can't. Hadley, you gotta move. We need that road. Captain, you're holding up half a battalion. Then give me something to move with. Give me something to do the job with. You talked about a tank, send it. I know it's essential, but my losses are heavy. I'm down to 50% effective as it is. Can't you send the tank? Mortars don't even touch them. I need big stuff. No good. Nothing. Get some mortar fire on RJ. We gotta have the 81s back before long. Well, that'll help. Maybe, but we can't wait, Hanley. You move against those bunkers now. I what? You're asking me to send my men up there again without cover? No heavy mortars, no tanks? It's not a request, Hanley. Sir, I've been up three times. We've been down three times. How many casualties do you think I can take? You go up again. Can't we wait for the tank? I'll give you ten minutes. That tank hasn't arrived, you move out again. And don't tell me it's tough. I know it is. But it's got to be done. A battalion is catching them from regiment, they want results. All right, Captain. We wait ten minutes. Then we try again. Right, sir. We're going up again. There's a gap on both sides of us. They want it closed. They want the road so we can advance all along the line. Lieutenant, we're one lousy half strength platoon here. What do they expect from us? The hills, the bunkers, the road. Well, are they crazy? We can't do that. It wouldn't be one man come off that hill. Those are the orders. Well, orders, it's easy to give orders. It's easy to send men out to die. That's been going on here all day long. Kirby! Let him go. Look, we've tried. Now we've done the best that we can do. You sit here and you tell us to go up on that hill. And we go up there and we get clobbered. Don't understand you can get clobbered so much and then you've just had it, Lieutenant. And believe me, we've had it. We're not going up there anymore. through Kirby lieutenant can't do it anymore I said are you through yes sir. yes sir I'm through You've had it rough. And now that you've told me all about it, get ready to do your job. All of you. We've only got eight minutes left.
He was just selling off, that's all. What does he know? I'd rather go up that hill a dozen times and stay down here and pick other men to go. What do they want from me? All the brass has to do is send the word down and they expect us to go out there again. They sit with their maps and their lines. They forget they're talking about flesh and blood. Men die when a bullet hits them. You know any casualties we have? How many dead? Ten. Ten men who were alive when I brought them in here today. Lying out there. On that lousy, stinking hill. through the tenant. I asked you if you were through. All right. You had it rough. And now that you told me all about it, you better... You better get ready to do your job. lying up on that hill. Like I'm backed off, just looking at my own body lying there. Just one time too many, that's all. What odds does Einstein give you? Doesn't even matter. The crowd up there right now, carving a notch on this gun butt. Go up there again, I'm gonna get it. I feel it. This time we're going up the middle. Zero it in on our flank movements. Keep low and don't punch up. Lay down all the fire you can. Take the best cover you can get. All right, stand by. For me, some guarantees you're going to make it. There aren't any. There's still two bunkers of Germans up there. They're going to keep us off those hills if they can. They've done a pretty good job of it, Lieutenant. We're going to leapfrog in twos and threes. 
First you with two men, Kirby. Kleinschmidt and Einstein. Next, Age, alone. Then Little John with Miller. The rest are on me. Get ready to move out. One time too many. Maybe he has a plan. It's some plan. You can write it on your tombstone. to see you. Yeah, everybody's glad to see me. What's your problem, the bunkers? Two of them. All they've shown us are machine guns. Well, we'll show them something else. Give me infantry cover. You got it. Okay, see you on top of the hill. Right. Hey, Kirby. Little John. Miller. Einstein! Feinschmidt! Back of the tank. Einstein, what about those odds? Are they getting any better? Looking better, Kirby. Looking better. About time. DC the driver. Forward up the road.
What do you mean you lost the tank? They had a rocket launcher. We couldn't stop them. They had time for one shot, but it's all they needed. We got the left bunker, but we're right back where we started. Well, nothing's changed, Hanley. You still gotta take that hill. The 81s are available. You want them? Hanley, you there? Yes, sir, I'm here. I asked you if you wanted the 81s. Yes, sir, I'll take the 81s. Captain, in exactly 10 minutes. Have those mortars lay down all the smoke they can on the right bunker. Yeah. Oh. We're going again. The reason they've been clobbering us is because they had a perfect field of fire. But well, they don't anymore. The tank's in the way. And we knocked out one of the bunkers. If a rocket launcher can hit the tank from a bunker, a bazooka can hit the bunker from the tank. We've got the 81 millimeters now. They're going to lay down a smoke screen for us. Kirby, you're the best bazooka man we've got. Pick yourself a loader. Get up to that tank and knock out that bunker. We'll have to move fast before the wind dissipates the smoke. We, oui, Lieutenant. We, oui, Kirby. First you. If you don't make it, somebody else. And if he doesn't make it, somebody else. We, oui, Kirby. You can load for me. Check those rockets out, will you? You've got talent, Kirby. You know, I always knew that that keen eye of yours would get you somewhere. Yeah, about six feet under. Long, long after we won this war, those crowds will still be up there, holding that hill like it was an independent sovereign state or something. The lieutenant sure keeps trying. He sure does. We don't make it this time. We've had it. You know, it's a one-note tune you're playing, Kirby. I've only got one life, my friend. <laughs> we really going up there again? Yeah, one more time. I can't. If I go back up there again, I'm gonna get hit. You too? I can tell, I can feel it. What you're feeling is that lousy breakfast you had this morning. Now snap out of it. This war's just gotten started. Kirby? No, wait, wait, wait a minute. Don't come out here with all the mods and books and everything. I don't even want to know about it anymore. I don't blame you. I know them. I'm scared of death. Hey, Kirby? Yeah? I've been thinking you've been going up and down that hill like a yo-yo all day long. You noticed that, huh? Yeah. What I was thinking was, I haven't really hardly done nothing. So how about letting me take the bazooka out, okay? Little John, you couldn't hit a bunker with this bazooka if you was inside it, and you know it. 
Forget it. Lieutenant picked the right man for the job. I've got no more ideas. This is all I've got. Sounds good, Lieutenant. With the smoke, it might work. You know, if we get enough smoke, we may have a chance. If a wind comes up anymore, it'll just blow it all away. That's a happy thought. I got a million of them. Oh, come on. Where's the smoke? It'll come. The American army has the finest logistical support in the world. I read that in a soldier's handbook. I hope that book told you how you're gonna get out of this alive. Well, anyway, good luck, Kirby. No, I can't lose. Big Moose here wishes me good luck. Now remember, wait till that smoke lays in real good. You're gonna need all the cover you can get. Don't worry, Lieutenant. I'll put on an exhibition of taking cover like you never saw before. The bunker. Just get it. We'll do what we can. That's not good enough, Kirby. Get it. And next, that's where we'll get it. If I'd never taken up mathematics, I don't know who won't hurt you. But I'll worry you two. You're getting smoke. Okay, Jim, you see smoke stop a bullet. Get some exercise.
time, next time, learn me! Fight, Rick, get busy! Fire! Come on, come on, give us some cover, will ya? Bunkers. You guys okay? Yeah. Hey, we did it! Lieutenant! Come on up! Everybody off the hill! Come on down! We're pulling back all along the line. You're, you're joking! Huh, Lieutenant? No, Kirby. The Germans counterattacked on our right. They broke through. We're pulling back to our original position. What about that road? They ordered that road! We got it! Yeah, it's all ours! And the bunkers! We knocked them out, Lieutenant! Come on down! All of you! No! We took the hill! This man here, I, I don't even know his name! He can't come down! Einstein can't come down! And Morgan, he can't either! We ain't coming down, Lieutenant! We took the hill! Come down! <laughs> Lieutenant, we took this hill! Come down!
Remember that hill. Every ditch and every dip in the ground. It may come in handy the next time. 